platform for a glimpse of your profile. I'd recognize you even after a while. You find you were fighting when the train crossed the river. It was your favorite part of the ride. I pretended I am flying, soaring with you. No, it could never come true. Break from all the things that I have to do with the rumbling and jolting. I pour out my feelings, something to show for. Hi, guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Violet and in today's video I am going to be riding or actually at least sitting on Juniper for the first time ever. So I've had Juniper for about a month or two now. And the reason we're doing this this quickly is because she was, or at least I'm supposing um, that she was already trained with tag because she just doesn't mind it. The lunging was going great. Um, she does buck occasionally like two to three times in a ride but that's perfectly normal normal for her age and um, I just thought that today was the perfect day because it is sunny and it's not that um, cold yet because in a very very short while it's gonna be sweater and long leaves uh, season but today as you can see I am wearing a protective wear um, and this is actually an airbag that was very kindly gifted to me and also i'm gonna be popping a helmet on today just because she is a young and unpredictable whore she's gonna be ridden for the first time ever supposedly um and i just want to keep her and myself safe so without any fur further ado let's just get on and tuck her up Today we went with this beautiful purplish set that kind of matches myself but I was wearing more of a blue toned shirt than purple but it was a good enough match. Then I also went with the matching purple boots and my jumping bridle, bridle. and also as I said I popped on my helmet as well and then I just let her out and today we are going to be in the round pen just because she doesn't have to focus on the direction she's going on and it's a little bit less scarier than the big arena but yeah then i just kind of gave gave her a few reassurance pads and then i slowly mounted on and just gave her a few seconds to get used to the feeling not asking her to do anything but just seeing if she'll react i also tried some hand and leg movements um to see if she were were to kind of um move or react but she was super super calm about it so then i dismounted and also gave her a few reassurance pads just to let her know that she definitely did a very very good job then i mounted again but this time i did ask her to move forward and she was very responsive to my leg cues and i was also very very gentle on her mouth because this is her first time riding with a bit supposedly um she was super super calm she was kind of doing better than um nova was when i wrote her for the first time after her, whatever her past was um then we were just kind of riding over to the hay bells right over here and she was just kind of looky at them so i just kind of let her have a look and she just kind of threw in a fit she just kind of got spooky so she bucked but then she kind of got out got along super super nicely and wasn't bothered by them anymore so we nicely continued our lap and then we came to the tree right over there so she just kind of bucked again to kind of test me 
um, and uh, I just kind of didn't budge. So then we tried to kind of change direction and I mostly used my hands to do this just to see if how she reacts on the bit and she was super responsive as well. And then we just walked around a bit on the other rain. Um, she got spooked by this little bush, but um, we got over it at the end. Then we went back into the other way and we did try a little bit of a trot. Uh, so first time we just trotted just a few steps, but um, she was super, super good. So I decided to ask for trot again and she was super nice and super responsive. So I was super, super proud of her and she did a really nice job and her trot is super nice. It's really comfortable. Um, then we changed direction and trotted on the other rein and then I was just kind of like, she did a super great job. So we called it quits for the day. But as you can see, she definitely wasn't bothered by me being on top of her and she just moved on super nicely and super comfortably she definitely gave me a semi-safe feeling obviously not totally safe because she is a young horse they are unpredictable but i don't know she has a really really nice feeling so as i said after that we did call it quits because i didn't want it to be an overload of emotions and to move it too quickly so yeah okay guys so we have now finished with our first writing session i couldn't be prouder of juniper she is super super nice to ride and she is really calm um she backed three times which i think is amazing for the first ride and she didn't rear anything and um yeah, it's, it was just an overall success, so yeah. Um, if you liked this video, make sure to like and subscribe because it really does help me out and I really do appreciate it. Make sure to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my other Juniper updates or other videos in general. Um, if you have any other ideas on the future videos, make sure to comment that down below i love replying to all of your comments but if you just want to chat i'm always available at on instagram at violet underscore braveword i love chatting up with you guys you can ask some people i definitely always reply when i see the text um just be um just be on watch there are time zones so i may not reply the same second but yeah, hopefully you have a really, really nice morning, day or night and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Bye!